Welcome back to the sixth Lua tutorial and in this episode we will learn how to use arithmetic cooperation and manipulating strings so if you have start your server go ahead and log in uh, as your admin account first of all do debug script 3 to get all the errors here and to debug your script and it will give you a line as I said in the last episode so yeah debug has set to 3 anyway let's start in this one well this lesson this lesson will be about arithmetic oh operation and string manipulation <coughs> so I need to, to tell you to tell you a couple of things before I start when you write when you write a uh, code like that when you write any code like that anyway the, the compiler load your script from so uh, if you have a variable like that uh, it will load it this will load it seconds and if you have functions it like that it will this will load first this will load second and so on so it will load it like that uh, yeah mm -hmm. Another thing is that you can change your variable. For example, I put x equal five. You can change it soon after some code. Uh, you can change it by doing this, uh, assigning to x another value like two or three, and any other variable, uh, even five. You can back it to five. Any anyway. Uh, so let's start our lesson uh, to know arithmetic operation we have plus subtract divide and multiply also modulus okay what are they addition is to add it to number two or no addition uh, subtract or minus anyway you know the those are arithmetic operation I think you know them I will give examples for plus x equal 5 y equal uh, 3 w equal x plus y so this is how to use the uh, addition addition operation this is an addition operation output chat box w it will output the 8 uh -huh. ah let me start it yeah it will output 8 we have 8 here anyway uh, you, you can also do that and also do that it will output 10 mm -hmm. you see 10 here uh, <coughs> minus minus is basically we, we use it like uh, addition we have 2 Ah, we have to yeah I think those are clear first four of those are clear but you may ask what the heck is modulus modulus well let me explain that modulus is the rest rest of the division if you have a division you have Q equal a apply B plus the rest 
so modulus will output the rest will output the rest we use it like that x equal 5 x equal 10 y equal 2 and modulus is x percent y we use it like that oh come on oh yeah start my script and we have zero the rest is zero the rest is zero here let's try three uh, as you know then e equal three multiplied by three plus one so the modulus here basically is is one will output one yeah let's try and we have one here you can try you can try another example four we have 10 equal 4 multiplied by 2 and the rest is 2 basically we'll output 2 and by restarting you will get the result 2 so this is the modulus I think it's clear right now so let me explain string manipulation right now string manipulation if you have string A equal I well I need to transform that to uppercase I should use string dot upper a and I should this is uh, MTA uh, LUA sorry uh, provided uh, function and we give on the first argument here uh, the, the string that we need to, to transform it to uppercase start my script and we have high uppercase yeah you can try lowercase by string dot lower yeah start my script and yeah hello there it's lowercase Mm, you, can, you can try more there's a lot of uh, string operations I will I will put the link below uh, containing all the functions about string manipulations can far you can try uh, string G sub okay, let me day we need the day I will format the date I will give let me explain what I am using I will give date uh, like numbers day uh, day month and the year uh, I will transform that for from from using string G sub day is one month year yeah this is my birthday basically anyway should use it like uh, uh, percent by percent oh at the right person yeah percent zero two digital percent zero two digital percent zero four digital and we I th I should give as argument here the day month and the year 
let's try that I hope it works uh, output chat box excuse oh, me oh yeah yeah should put sub here yeah oh no it's not working basically I have did, I did something wrong right here basically maybe it work right now I'm not uh, oh it's format string format not g sub a string format yeah valid option I think it should work right now start my script yeah it worked we can ha find zero one zero nine it's first September yeah this is my birthday day my birthday Basically, you use a string format. Sorry, I confused about format and G sub. But you use basically a string format to make something like that. You may, uh, you may use digital here. D is stand for digital. Here, the number of digitals, and uh, the percent basically to 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 inform the compiler that you will insert uh, something here. Uh, you will find uh, I will put a link below for those digital and strings and hexadecimals things uh, to explain all of that. Anyway, this is a hard example. This is uh, kind of complicated for uh, beginners. Uh, let's try another thing like string find a equal uh, hello. Uh, no. Don't forget double quotes to 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 define the string. B equal H. Oh no <laughs> no H. So uh, if ah uh, I will use condition here. Don't care about that. I will explain conditions in the later uh, lessons in the next episodes. Find B A. Find B find the letter B which is well find the v ah, how to explain that find H in the l in the the string hello yeah if then and okay basically if if uh, the compiler find that he will output here he will uh, output wait a minute and we output yeah I find it my script uh, there is nothing so I basically we should try to reverse that anyway yeah I find it so sh you, sh you should Put the letter first, uh, the, the the string first, and the letter that you need to to f to, to find. For example, uh, ah, I need to find D. Yeah, I found it. It said, uh, "Yeah, I found it." So uh, that is it. String dot find. Well, I will not explain all the functions as I said. Uh, as I said, I just explain just a little. And you check the link below. There is uh, examples and it's explained and detailed. Well, uh, I think yeah. A equal i. and uh, b5 uh, no those are the number of repeats uh, don't care about that result string dot rep 
repeat this is stand for string dot repeat and we put the string we need to repeat in the first argument and the number of repeats in, in the second one uh, we need to output that no uh, it's very slow it's very slow oh come on it's very slow it's very sl output chat box result Come on, it's very slow, it's very slow. Oh my god. Uh, I'm waiting. Oh, finally. Save and start. Uh, try to restart. Start. And yeah, it's it said hi, 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 hi. Anyway. <laughs> this is a funny example. Anyway, I think that is it at the moment. Uh, do subscribe if you haven't yet. Uh, do like uh, if you if you learn something new. And if you have any question, uh, pause below. Sorry for uh, the string dot gsub uh, error. I confused about format and gsub because they are kind of similar. I will put the link below that uh, explain gsub more because I will not explain that anyway. Uh, yeah, the n the next lesson will be about uh, basically uh, how to make conditions and uh, logical operation. Uh, so at the moment, sh I should said bye. See you next time.